already Libra and now we get to in Scorpion already Scorpio let's see here they are I don't know what to say really but bear with me guys three four Scorpio past present and future what to let go of what to embrace best path forward okay man it's getting dry it's really getting dry so that's what happens when it gets cold the furnace will kick in and then it gets dry best we have a nine of wands present we have a knight of wands future we have a seven of cups all right scorpio you have the ability okay you have the ability to charge up that battery you've done it in the past look at your nine of wands you know how to get near completing goals achieving things okay making dreams come true you have that ability and it works for you in the present because right now we're looking at a knight of wands the energy of someone who truly is inspired and wants to take action to improve their lives in different ways maybe it's being coupled maybe it's growing their business maybe it's advancing in their career but really you have tasted success in the past and you know how to get to it and now presently you are taking action to repeat something and in the future you are proceeding with such confidence knowing that you are at the top of your game as I say that you guys take it with a grain of salt, but that's the story I'm getting from those three. Okay, there will be the satisfaction for you future wise, okay, to achieve successes, knowing that you are at the top of your game. Remember though, how we got there, because in the past, we've also learned the steps it takes to get to that kind of achievement, success or fulfillment. Alrighty, Scorpio, what to let go of? What should we let go of? Okay, <laughs> the strength. What am I gonna say, Scorpio? Okay, power perceived is power achieved. I typically look at this card and say, this isn't a power struggle. This is actually trust that has been established between this person and this line to the point that she's actually comforting them. It's a tough conversation they have to have, but she has to get something out of their jaw. Okay, so, the ability to establish trust okay we need to work on that possibly but then there is something else the way that we work on that is if you are intensely intensely appearing strong persona if this is something that happens for you if you appear to be a very very dominant character I don't blame you for that guys and again I don't know if I'm speaking with the rising the Sun the moon but let's just consider that um, that is something that we can tweak a little bit turn it around turn it around okay the inner strength that shows turn that around and then it works to your advantage and then you become the helper okay versus the strong persona <laughs> what to embrace more of as you make changes guys always figure out your facts five of swords as you make changes to any existing plans you got to have data you have to have facts okay and as if to say less changes really and best path forward okay the ace of swords scorpio your new ideas guys you've had you know what some you know what good energies that put you in a position now to capitalize on opportunities we have some personal developments or development subjects around communication perhaps that we need to work on we're going to make a bit of a change around that and then that's going to put you as i mentioned or maybe i haven't mentioned but on a leadership path i just want to say that to you uh, doesn't necessarily take us to work leadership could be also you being the best mother or father or parent that could be applied into family areas as well okay all righty scorpio